we are going to talk about our favorite bike races featuring Matthew Vanderpool, starting with you, Michael. Um, you've been talking about this race literally since Flow Bike started broadcasting bike races. This is one of the first bike races Flow Bikes has ever broadcast. Finally, you are sharing it with the world. Yes, and this is the 2017 DVV Ronza cyclocross race. And this is, uh, in my opinion, the best Matthew Vanderpool versus Wout Van Art battle that the world has seen. <laughs> the two of them had the race in their hands. They were clearly the strongest riders, but they were just hate racing each other throughout <laughs> the entire cross race. Uh, a, a lead group would form, they would rip it apart. One of them would attack, everybody would get dropped. It would come back together, they would sit up. And it was with two laps to go, Lars Vanderhaar, who had managed to claw his way back up to Matthew Vanderpool and Wout Van Aert. Lars attacked, and the two favorites, Vanderpool and Van Aert, just they just looked at each other. They sat up, they got caught by uh, a big chasing group, and Lars Vanderhaar stormed on to win. It was a huge disappointment for both Vanderpool and Van Aert, but it just shows the rivalry that these two riders have. And in my opinion, um, we love watching Matthew Vanderpool win, but they're all kind of shallow victories, I think, unless he just has somebody, has a foil, has a rival, and there's no better rival for Vanderpool than Van Aert. When we see the two of them go at each other and throw their races away to kind of spite each other, it's just great entertainment. I love it. Well, I think, too, this is uh, sort of what was at the pinnacle of the Vanner Vanderpool rivalry, you know, which really culminated leading up to this race in 2017, going back to cycle cross uh, season the previous year. Vanderpool really went on through the rest of 2017 to dominate Vanner and over the next couple seasons has proven that he is obviously the world's best cycle cross racer. So it, it, I feel like this is one of the last times that we really got to see a classic Vanner Vanderpool battle, so much so that they didn't even win. And then coming into the final lap, they were still going at it. Like Vanner attacks, Vanderpool sits on him and comes around for second. But again, um, <laughs> again, I, I, I will say that was maybe the pinnacle of their cyclocross rivalry, but I think sure. that we're going to see a lot more Van Aert Vanderpool uh, battles. And uh, yeah, they're going to be going at it for the next decade as they transition to road racing, which they are both doing quite well at, at the moment.